Installing SK Learn. Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics. And I was just realizing that if we're gonna do this, we need to start from the beginning. So I converted over to Spider, this editor, um, and I don't want you to feel that you need to spend time getting used to it because there's, there's some uh, comfort level learning. So I want you to be able to just use the regular Python editor. So I'm going to show you how to install um, SK Learn here and in the regular Python. So let's just go ahead and get started. So now, a couple of things. Um, and I've been talking and chatting with a couple of individuals. So let me show you the easiest way to do this. So you open where your so you open where your Python that you're currently using. So I had an older version uh, with the Python editor. So I wanted to show you that there are install s kit. I think it's this. So there are dependency issues with versions. So it's supported versions. So that's what you want to think about. So this, the reason why I'm showing you this is the 3.8. Um, this is showing, uh, this is showing that it's already installed in 3.12. So the reason why I'm showing you this is if you have a version if you're trying to install a Python module library, whichever term you're used to, and it's not, it's saying it's having some sort of error or some dependencies. So that's what that is basically a red flag for saying the version of Python that you have that you're trying to install this, the most current version of that library is not compatible with your current version of Python. So you can do something specific where you can go and say pip install and then actually name the version of the library or that takes a little bit more of some syntax or you can get the most updated version of Python which happens to be 3.12 right now put that on your machine and then go to let's see same here we are and i accidentally this is a second attempt of this recording because i did not have audio and it's just c um when you go to this path it's cmd for command and then you get your command prompt that's the old one and then here we are with python 3.12 and you would do pip install whichever library and in the last video <laughs> I showed you that what will also happen is this pip application this pip um, exe uh, exec file it will also understand it has a list of libraries that whichever library you're needing or dependent upon it will then install those as well but it's just pip install skit learn and that will do it and of course here it is right here uh, oh and here are the four libraries that are needed numpy uh, scipy joblib and uh, thread pro th thread pool so um, I think that's pro protocols so and then they install it in the proper location but when you're going to install you just go right to wherever your Python lives and then just type CMD. And then also, if you do already have Anaconda software, which that's where I run my spider, you can just go into here, to into the environments, you find um, what you're looking for, and you literally just click the box, because right now it's here because it's installed, and then there's gonna be an apply that shows up down here on this line right here 
uh, da, 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 it will show up right around here and it will handle all the dependencies that it needs as well. But like I said, we're going to do this entire journey from start to finish. And uh, midweek last week, I realized, hey, we haven't even shown anybody how to install this on our machine. So there we go, guys. Um, quick video for the week. Um, please drop any comments, questions, video requests. And as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned and we'll see you next time. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. Thanks for joining us today. I hope you really enjoyed today's video. And if you haven't, check out this video right here or this one right down here. And most important, make sure you're hitting this subscribe button and the notification bell. Thanks again for joining us, and we hope to see you next time. Bye, guys.